check out these adventures. Good morning, Mason. Happy Monday. Oh, somebody's in a good mood for a Monday. Maybe it's because the weather, ooh, my hair's a little crazy, sorry about that. Um, the weather's gonna change this week. It's gonna be colder for us and lots of rain. It's supposed to rain Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So don't know what kind of baseball or practice we're gonna get in this week. We'll see what the weather is gonna do. But it's Monday, it's a new week. We're excited, we're ready, we're pumped. It's almost Thanksgiving. Eventually we'll be having family come into town. That's exciting. Um, what else do we got going on? I think I need to get to Trader Joe's maybe today. I need a lot of stuff just to kind of stock up. I'm running out mm -hmm. of all of my staples. Uh -huh. But I also know, Mason, that they have a lot of their Christmas mm -hmm. stuff out. So what do you think? Should I go to Trader Joe's while you're at, at school today? Yeah. Mm, a lot of peppermint stuff. Peppermint JoJo's. Peppermint Oreos, basically. But good morning. Happy Monday. Have a good week, bud. How about some eggnog? Oh yeah, we can get some eggnog. Look where I just came back from. Definitely went to Trader Joe's, like I said earlier. Excited, some fun stuff in here, so I will go through all of that. Mason's gonna be excited. And a little tip, make sure you guys are watching this vlog. We will be opening this sometime this week. And we have a little bit of an announcement about plate crate. So stay tuned for that. Get excited. But let me get everything out because it seems to be easier and I'll show you my Trader Joe's haul. All right, I laid everything out. So the freezer was a little bit bare, so it was definitely time to get some frozen stuff. I did get one item that we have not tried. I don't know if it's new or not. But I think the boys will like that. So that's something new that we haven't had. And then I always like to have on hand gluten free. Both of these are breakfast for me. The boys both like these. Just easy, fast, and it's something easy for practice. I also like to have these on hand. Something simple, easy, fast to make. Um, you guys know I've had these before. Um, it's easy to put in eggs, quesadillas, it's frozen. These are the best hash browns ever. Highly recommend them. And of course, um, we always have to have this on hand. Definitely yummy. Um, for easy, fast practices. Um, and then this. This is new. I haven't had that yet, but it's like you get two potatoes in there. I don't know, that could be an easy lunch for me. Let's try that out. Of course, I always have to have these. These are easy fast breakfast. Or snack, late night snack. They're yummy. It's kind of like carrot cake, that's how I think it tastes. So I can definitely eat that if I have like the munchies late at night. At least it's a little bit better option than something sweet. Got these for the boys. Um, always where we were at is um, we fed beans. So these we found, I don't know, a few times ago when I went with the salsa in there. Those are good. Best apples ever. So we were down to our last apple. So I got another bag of those. Strawberries, I have a pink strawberries and my oatmeal. And my Cheerios, I just dice them up. Um, same thing with my oatmeal. Thinking I could put some dry cranberries in there. These are always nice to have. To put in cereal, same thing, oatmeal. Easy snack, healthier snack. The boys are out of milk, so we're gonna have to get them some milk. Got these from Mason, uh, I think the last time maybe I went. And you like them. So if you're ever running behind in the morning, getting to school, you can always grab them in these, eat for breakfast. And then, they didn't have pumpkin gluten-free bagels. I was so upset, but I went in and got the everything bagel. And then, this is like the seasonal Christmas stuff. So, this is, we've had these before. They kind of remind me of, um, Swedish fish, I guess. But this is supposed to be like a Christmas flavor, so I'm curious to see what those taste like. And then I got these for the boys. Looks like they're peppermint, but you know, the thin uh, pepper dipped in peppermint. And what is that, maybe yogurt? I don't know. I think the boys will like that. And then, Jack sampled one of Sam's Club um, Oreos that were uh, candy, cane, candy cane flavored Oreos. So I figured this is almost like a little step up. So JoJo's are pretty much the same thing as an Oreo. It's just Trader Joe's way of naming the Oreos. So this one's actually in different chocolate, so that looks good. So this, we've been buying these every time. I actually put them in my trash can so that the trash smells nice. This, haven't seen this flavor before. I'm gonna go ahead and give that a try. It's iced gingerbread. I'm not for sure if I'm huge on gingerbread, but it's worth a try. Got this for Mason. I thought that would be fun for him. It's got chocolate in it. It's a little advent calendar for him. Can't believe it's almost December. And then, I'm excited for this. So, I tried not to do a lot of dairy. So, this is an almond creamer. I'm thinking for my coffee in the morning. Because I never get to get that peppermint flavor in my coffee. Um, so, I'll try that. And then, Mason this morning said he wanted eggnog. So, this is almond nog. I think I can drink this. Hopefully, he'll like it. But if some reason he doesn't like this, I'll just go get him regular eggnog. But I was thinking then, yeah, the whole family can enjoy this. Because, there you go. Gluten free, dairy free. All the good stuff there, so I can have that. And, of course, we got some new fresh flowers because these ones are starting to look a little sad. But that is my Trader Joe's haul. This is about three bags worth of stuff, and I spent, I think, $87, almost $90. The one thing, the one thing that I wanted from Trader Joe's today was their gluten-free stuffing for Thanksgiving, and they were all out. He said that they're getting a shipment in, sometime tonight, so it should be on the shelves first thing in the morning. So I think I'm gonna have to go back because he says the stuff flies off the shelf. I know it's good, I heard it's good. So I really want it for Thanksgiving. So I think I might go back tomorrow 
and hopefully it'll be on the shelf. Welcome home from school. Guess what? What? Guess where mom went? Trader Joe's. Where's mom? I bring you all of the holiday stuff. What do you think? 24 days of milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. Advent calendar, so you get to every night, you'll be able to, that'll be your dessert every night till Christmas, starting in December. Okay. By the way, guys, this was only 99 cents. What a steal. Really? Yep. Look at these. These are like Oreos. Mm -hmm. Mom already got into these. What are they? They're yum. They're like Swedish fish. And you like these, right? Yep. Ooh. You gonna try them? Uh. All right. Try them on the vlog. Mom thought they were good. Let's see what Mason thinks. Yay or nay? Oh, he went for more. He must like them. Tastes like Swedish fish, kind of. Similar. Thinking about it? Those are good. Those are good? Mm-hmm. All right. Guess what else I got? Oh. Eggnog. Okay. Okay. Well, welcome home from school. Mm -hmm. And he can't do his homework. Why? Because he it's forgot it at school. It's the Think freaking facts. I know. Thankfully, it's not due tomorrow. So he'll just remember to pick him up tomorrow. Bring him home and do homework tomorrow. Yep. You can't forget, mister. No. <laughs> What's up guys, sorry, I forgot to let you guys know. Took Mason to do a little bit of hitting. We went hitting tonight. Uh, thought process there, it's supposed to rain like the next two days, which means we may or may not be practicing baseball. And when it rains in AZ, all the, pretty much most of the batting cages get booked out quickly. So sometimes we get a cage, sometimes we don't. So I told him, I was like, well, I don't know how much baseball we're gonna do this week. So if we're uh, gonna get rained out, let's get some hitting in. So we just did that. Didn't tell you guys where we were going, but obviously, hopefully, I tried to set the camera up, it's tough when just him and I go, because I'm usually trying to balance it in a bucket or a glove or something like that, so it makes it a little bit difficult. But uh, hopefully we got a few clips there. We'll find out in the editing process. But now we're gonna eat some Din Din and then go watch some Monday Night Football. Good morning, happy Tuesday. You ready for the rain? Well, they, um, they say it's gonna rain. Right now, nothing, it's dry. Like, I don't want it to rain on me because that kind of sucks. We got school. Like, I want rain because, like, it hasn't rained in a while. We so. do need rain. Yes, we always need rain in the beautiful state of Arizona. But I think it's supposed to rain right when this guy is supposed to go to baseball practice. So, we'll keep a lookout. The worst case scenario, drive into baseball practice and then it starts raining because that's happened before. So, don't cancel it until it absolutely starts to rain so we'll see but have a good Tuesday and don't forget to get your homework because you need to work on that tonight oh. well I did what the guy told me yesterday at Trader Joe's I went to the gym this morning and I stopped back at Trader Joe's on the way home and guess what he was right look what was back on the shelves that's what I wanted yesterday so went ahead and picked that up and then I went ahead and got some gluten-free, vegan, dairy-free gravy. The lady checking me out said that this is pretty good. A little runny, but it'll work. And then I got this. You guys, here's a tip. Trader Joe's also has cute little things that you can give away for Christmas gifts. Um, so this is actually gonna be a Christmas gift. I picked it up now just to make sure that they didn't run out of them. So that's going to, look how cute that is. It's all packaged, super cute. So that's going to be a Christmas gift. And then while I was there, I went ahead and picked up lunch. That's going to be my lunch today. 
So yeah, I was glad that the guy did not steer me wrong. I was like, you promised me that if I drive back here, you'll have it, and he was right. So that works, I'm excited. An update on the rain. No rain yet, but the clouds are definitely starting to roll in. As you can tell, it's a little bit dark outside. So we're still waiting for the rain and the baseball practice. We'll see if that's gonna happen today. Weather update. Yep, that's water. I don't think that baseball is gonna happen today. Bummer. Welcome home from school. Did he bring his homework home? Yeah. Oh, you just said, oh shoot. I was like, you better not have forgot. I was talking about the dribbling. Oh. Well, you're gonna go ahead and work on that. And guess what I just got? Text message saying no practice. practice is canceled tonight. So you have all night to get that homework done. Yay! Boo. Have fun. Rather go to baseball. <laughs> I'm sure you would. Good afternoon, I guess. It's almost four o'clock, almost I could say good evening, I guess. It is a Wednesday, and you guys, it's just been one of those days. I've literally been in sweats all day. I did get to the gym, so I got my workout in, but I came home, cleaned all the sheets on all the bedding. Um, what else did I do? I don't know, I just kind of laid around a lot today because this is why. It's just a gloomy day. It's been raining off and on all day. So it's just one of those days you want to be on in your sweats. This guy's home from school. How's school? Amazing? No. Not really. It's school, I know. But since it's just kind of gloomy out, I put chicken tortilla soup in the crock pot so that's cooking. Mason and I just enjoyed some smoothies, and I have the last load of blankets drying in the dryer. So I think those are about done. I'm gonna go finish all the beds. It's just been one of those days, but it's kinda nice. It's kinda nice to have a lazy day, lazy rainy day. Who likes rainy days? Leave a comment down below. We don't get them that often here in Arizona, but when we do, we sure do enjoy them. So I think it's supposed to rain all through the night and even into tomorrow, so. No! Rain yesterday, lots of rain. Like we said earlier in the vlog, we need it. So I'm okay with it. All right guys, we're about ready to dig into some yummy tortilla chicken soup. But first, like I said earlier in the vlog, it is time to open that plate crate. Hashtag my plate crate. Mason, do you want to tell them what to do? You could use code BEVO20. For $20 off your first plate crate. But first, before Mason opens his plate crate, we have an announcement. We have another giveaway coming for you guys right Whoa. now. So here's what you guys have to do. Today's Saturday. I'm going to post a picture of Mason holding up this plate crate right here. You guys need to leave a comment down below. Boys, what should they comment? Ooh. Ooh. What do they have to comment down below, Mason? Web gem. Web gem, mm. which I do believe is the is the theme yes. for this month of November. Links, to... sorry, didn't mean to cut you off. Links down below for our Instagrams and our links to Plate Crate as well. Mm -hmm. So both of them are there for you. So even if you don't win the giveaway, all the links are down below. Check out my Instagram, Chrissy's Instagram. Follow us. Fun updates in live in real time on our Instagram over there. And I, did you say? I know, I was gonna say, and you guys are probably wondering, what is the giveaway? Oh, yeah. So the giveaway is one lucky winner is not going to get just one month, not two months, but three months of plate crate coming to you. So you guys know what to do on the photo in Instagram. Get over on my the Instagram. Mason holding up this plate crate. Make sure you comment web gem down below on that to hopefully get three months worth of plate crate, which is a great deal. All right, the time has come. You Are ready? Yes. I thought she was gonna say to raise the roof and have some fun. Well, maybe. She didn't. Raise the roof and have some fun. Let's go. Let's enter the plate crate. Web gem. Okay. Okay. I'm already liking what I'm seeing. Start off with this. Where's the uh... Oh. Go ahead. 
Go ahead, buddy. Hashtag bandit sports. Bandit sports again. I don't know why I said hashtag, but. <laughs> they probably have a hashtag. I, I don't know. I'm a big fan of, anytime I see bandit sports, I get excited. We got some ladders, right? Oh yes, boy. So you we know got the some ladder very speed well. Speed ladder for training and agility. Speed training, agility. We can use a parachute that our friends at Play Crate sent us another month mm -hmm. to maybe do both. Okay. And then we got a uh, fueling glove that's flat. So you have to Ooh. use two it's hands. It's called pancake glove. Okay. So work on two hands. So I see. Um, so far, so good. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Old gloves back in the day, if you like. <laughs> yes, <it's laughs> we got a reaction ball. So Very it like cool. bounces. So it's the same thing for training. Bounces so different. bounces it helps you yeah. read and react to a baseball combination. Because unfortunately baseballs take bad hops. Yeah. I don't know why. That is That's true. That's how you train for the web gems. And then we got a web gem sticker. Ooh, I like that one. Web gem. We got ourselves. A mini bat. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's a glove mallet. Oh, cool. You're breaking those gloves. So in order to make those web gems, you gotta have your glove broken in and ready to go. So that'd be cool. So if yeah, you, so I'm in, in the background, if you hear, do, 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 yep. do. And then lastly, but not least, obviously, you have to have the monthly Play Crate t-shirt. Web gem. Mm -hmm. Like the colors on that one. Very sweet. You see that bad boy. All right, let's get a little close up. So there's that flat glove, training glove, and then the ladder system, and the training ball, the mallet. That's that's solid. Get them gloves Sticker. broken in quickly. Get them gloves again. And of course the t-shirt. Shout out to Play Crate. Thank you to Michelle and Josh at Play Crate. Love getting these. Love the fact that they allow us to even share it with you guys with some giveaways. Yes. Hopefully more of these down the road. But the next person that wins it, it's a big giveaway. Three months of Play Crates. You're gonna get boom, boom, boom. Three different Play Crates coming at your doorstep. One lucky winner this time. Go check out the links. Go to Instagram. And if you don't win, it's still an awesome thing that can show up on your doorstep every mm -hmm. single month. Like we said, the themes. That Make sure you use our promo code. Use the promo code BEVO20, get $20 off your first. And if you're, we have people that have been on Playcrate for two years now since they started getting it from mm -hmm. the original time they got and used our promo code. So, mm -hmm. you know, we love it and we know you guys will love it too. Now, who's ready for some soup? Me. That I'm ready for. That's tonight's <laughs> theme. <laughs> it's ready. <laughs> Caught you singing. <laughs> and there's the finished product. I'm going like now room, room, room two. Anybody seen that video? <laughs> what is it? Bad lip singing? Is that what it is? Yeah. Star Wars? Pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy Thursday, everyone. I can't believe I'm gonna say this, but you guys, it's been another rainy day. A huge storm just came through. Some parts got hail. I don't think it ever hailed here, but we got our door open, the fresh air, loving it. I just had a hot cup of hot tea, made Jack some coffee. He's getting some editing done. Mason's in the front room getting some homework done. See if I can spy on him. There he is. <laughs> I think he's getting some math homework done. We do have hitting practice tonight for baseball because clearly we cannot use the fields because they are all soaking wet. So we're headed to the batting cages later on tonight, which means I can cook some dinner tonight. So I'm gonna go ahead and probably start on that. I think I need to start cooking around five just so we can get to baseball on time. <laughs> Happy Friday, three miles in, 51 beautiful degrees. I'm ready to start my weekend now. That felt great. After three days of rain, 
The air was awesome. Probably one of the best runs ever. <laughs> but it's Friday. We made it to the weekend. Everybody is home from school, work. Jack's working on the vlog right now. I think we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog. We're having a little bit of a snack. All of us have snacks. There's Jax, just waiting for him. Um, Mason has something at his future high school later on tonight, so getting something in our belly and then we'll do dinner later on after that's over with. But I think we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog right now. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time. Subscribe to subscribe. Like this video and comment in the comment section. And for check that in the sky across the video entries and last by video adventures and don't press the bell down below so you know if I more press the next video and don't check out next time's adventures. Enter those giveaways guys. For Planet Green.